I purchased a Kobe cassette recorder to, to listen to some old tapes that, uh, childhood memory tapes, um, music and um, family gatherings. And to actually listen to the tapes is um, pretty good. Um, it does play fairly well. Um, the only problem I'm having with it is trying to record. It has a horrible uh, grinding, um, staticky background noise in any kind of recordings. And I'll show you. Um, you hit the record button and I'll do a test here. Uh, this is the Colby Cassette Recorder CVR-22. I'm doing a test. Test one, two, three. Test one, two, three. And then when I hit rewind, it will not rewind. It will stop. And to make the sound like it's trying to go, but it's not. So the only way I can rewind is if I hold the rewind button down. And then it works. Now I'll play it back and you will hear the background noise. And I'll do a test here. This is the Kobe cassette recorder CBR22. I'm doing a test. Test one, two, three. Test one, two, three. So you hear the very loud background noise in the recording. There again, it's not working. So I have to hold it down to rewind and mash stop. Um, to buy this to listen to old cassette tapes is fine. But if you're going to record, I wouldn't suggest it because it does have um, this horrible background noise. It's actually picking up the, um, the tape recording. Um, the tape winding and any kind of mechanical noise in the recorder, it is recording that. So the background overrides your voice actually. Um, and that's the thing I don't like about it other than the rewind button not working properly. It does come with a charger. Uh, it is portable. You can put batteries in it as I have batteries in it now. Um, and I guess for the price, it's okay as far as listening to old tapes, but definitely not to record on.